us. The man accused of shooting and killing Mobile police officer Sean Tudor in court today. Marco Perez pleaded not guilty this afternoon. News 5's Dana Winter was in the courtroom. She joins us live from Government Plaza with the details. Dana? Well, Devin, the courtroom was full of members of Officer Sean Tudor's National Guard Unit and Mobile Police as Marco Perez stood before the judge. Today's biggest issue, though, the handcuffs on Perez's wrists. The defense taking pictures of these handcuffs to show the judge the cuffs have a Tudor's name on them. Now, the defense says the cuffs are not typical to ones that are used when they bring people to court, and they want them removed. Quite unusual. It's not necessary. Let's just treat everyone like you would anybody else accused of an offense. You want to talk about fair? Okay. Um, the defendant has all the rights here, and we will make sure that all of the defendant's rights are um, represented, and um, that will be fair. Everything in these proceedings will be fair. Mobile County District Attorney Ashley Rich says the jail is responsible for the cuffs. And I got off the phone with the Mobile County Sheriff's Office who told me that the cuffs will no longer be used on Perez. The judge does say that Perez is able to apply for youthful offender status. The preliminary hearing for Perez will take place next Tuesday. That is February 12th at 3.30 in the afternoon. Reporting live outside the courthouse in downtown Mobile, Dana Winter, WKRG News 5. Thank you.